What's up guys, Julian Goldie here, and if you're watching this video, you might be interested in how you should promote a new business, or you might be reviewing your current marketing strategy. Either way, you're probably asking yourself the question, what's the best option to go with first, SEO or paid ads? You might even be feeling a little brave and wondering if you should do both of these marketing tactics at the same time. Well, whichever camp you fall into, keep watching, because in this video, we're going to take a good look at why you might want to focus on SEO first. Now, that might sound like a bold claim, but by the time you finish with this video, you'll understand where we're coming from. So SEO versus paid ads. Should you really focus on SEO first? Okay, to begin with, let me just say that paid ads are awful and you should never use them ever, ever. Just kidding. No, I'm only joking. But the thing is, right, don't get me wrong, paid ads are amazing. I mean, you could switch them on and generate your first customers within an hour. What's not to love? But should we just end the video there? Is that it? Discussion over, debate settled, why bother with SEO when paid ads are so awesome? Well, it's also worth remembering that if an ad platform decides to ban you from their platform, which can happen even if you've done nothing wrong sometimes, you can end up with no way to generate customers. Plus, if you turn off your paid ad campaigns, you'll simply have no way to generate revenue and your business will come to a stop. But, okay, both of these are things explaining why paid ads aren't all they're cracked up to be, but they don't really explain why you should focus on SEO first. So with that said, why should you focus on SEO? Well, the main reason you should prioritize SEO is because it takes a lot of time to actually kick in. Now, that might sound like a negative thing, and it kind of can be sometimes, but stick with me here, okay? Because in many cases, it can take a number of months to see results from SEO. Once you've decided to create and stick, to an SEO strategy. And it's because of this that you should sort out your SEO efforts before you focus on PPC. In doing so, you can then rest easy as you know the SEO side of your business is taken care of. In some ways, I guess dieting would be a good comparison to draw here. You can create and seek to a solid dieting plan, but it might take a few months until you begin to hit your target weight. Now, does that mean that nothing is happening in the meantime between your diet and the time when you hit your target weight. Of course not. It's just not that sustainable. Progress often comes slowly and things don't happen all at once. And SEO is a lot like this. You create a solid SEO strategy and then you implement it over the coming months. And if you stay consistent, you will eventually see results that are meaningful. Okay, but why bother going through this effort if SEO takes so long? Well, SEO can bring you targeted customers at a very low cost when compared to paid advertising, meaning your profit margins are much higher. And therefore, the sooner you get started, the sooner you will experience these amazing events. Also, if you focus on SEO as soon as you can, your website will slowly gain authority and improve keyword rankings as the days go by. And as this happens in the background, you can then tinker with other marketing methods so that you can generate customers in the meantime. Of course, once you start ranking for your keywords, then you can think about doubling down on your SEO and perhaps stopping your paid ads. SEO is also your insurance policy because Something else I want to touch on here is that SEO can act as a great marketing insurance policy. And this is a big reason as to why you should focus on it first. And this might sound a little odd, but hear me out, okay? Now look, marketing is perhaps one of the most important parts of running a business. I mean, it doesn't matter how good your product or service is. If you can't market your business, your bottom line isn't going to look too good. So if you're just relying on one marketing strategy, it's fair to say that you're putting your business in a really dangerous position. As we talked about earlier, paid ad platforms can be very temperamental. And one day they're sending you lots of lovely customers at a decent price. And the next day you're dealing with tons of competition and high ad prices that eat into your margins. And worst case scenario, they decide they don't like something about your ad and they suspend or ban. Now, if you focus on SEO first, you will at least have that insurance policy in the event that a paid ad platform decides to make life difficult. And so the sooner you focus on SEO, the sooner this insurance policy will kick in. For example, if you focus on SEO first, you will at least be ahead of the curve if your ads suddenly fail. After all, suppose that it takes six months to achieve decent rankings. If you don't focus on SEO, this six month timeline will start whenever you decide to switch your attention from paid ads to SEO. If you're unable to generate customers without paid ads to SEO, this waiting period might just shut down your business. However, if you focus on SEO first, you might have to only wait a few months or you might not have to wait at all, all of which means that your business will keep ticking along nicely. Now, after hearing all of this, you might be asking yourself, can't SEO go wrong too? 
After all, what if things are the other way around? What if you do SEO first and then you end up getting delisted by Google? What then? Did you just waste a lot of effort? Well, that's a perfectly reasonable thing to consider. But it's important to remember that if you don't do things the right way, you shouldn't really have to worry about this. Now, you might be thinking, I don't have the time to learn SEO or how it works or what actually counts as the right way to go about things. This is often the issue a lot of business owners run into. After all, most people are so busy running their business, they don't have the time to learn the various intricacies of a particular marketing method like SEO. So if you find yourself in this position, you might want to book in a free consultation call with us. We've helped loads of other businesses achieve success with SEO, and there's a good chance we can help you too. Either way, hopefully you now understand why it's a good idea to focus on SEO first. I hope this video has been helpful for you. And if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to get in touch. Thanks.